Hi, this is Vladan from SX Virtualization Block. Today I'm going to show you uh, what if you have a problem with your vSphere data protection appliance and you need to redeploy the appliance and reattach back to your disks where you have the backups stored. So you basically need to redeploy the OVF file, that's what I have already done, and you need to connect back via the management configuration interface. The password is change me. It's the default password. Default password. Come on, change me. Okay, I'm on English keyboard. <laughs> okay, so let's move on. I already assigned the IP address, the same IP address as, as the VDP appliance that I had a problem with. Keep the defaults for now. Choose a password for the new appliance. Center IP <clears throat> okay, so is the administrator at Labdo Slogal domain credentials. Okay, and here attach existing storage. And now I shall browse to the storage where I'm storing the data files which contains my backups actually. I think this is this. I can only select once one disk at a time, don't know why. I believe it's gonna take some time. Oh, I see. So I have to select disk by disk. Okay. Why not? And the third disk. Okay. So what I have done, I redeployed a new VDP appliance, the system disks, and then I have pointed to the data disks, which I'm storing on different data store. 
accept the defaults. Oh. It asks me for the previous password. I put in the same one. And it works. Okay, I'm gonna pause the video a bit. Okay, we have to reconnect again. Hmm. I think the appliance is still rebooting. Guess it's initializing the management services and so on. Oh, the plugins. Connect to the vCenter. I still have the, the plugin, but the appliance at the moment is initializing and it takes up to 20 minutes actually for the first time. The appliance to boot up. So I'm gonna pause the video. Okay, we are now about 15 minutes later, and we're gonna to try to connect to the vSphere client again. Troubleshoot is no. Okay, connect. Yes. Ah, still doing some integrity checks in the background. And here are the backups. I have one backup of one backup of 2008 standard server and one backup of Red Center server appliance and uh, one application backup of my SQL database. So what I have done actually is that my VDP appliance crashed. So I had to redeploy a new VDP appliance and attach my data disk is back to this new VDP appliance. And I can recover my backups from this point. 
but I think I have to recreate my backup jobs. That's the only problem. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.